Welcome to New Braunfels, Texas. New Braunfels was founded in 1845. It served as a huge hub during the Civil War, providing supplies and materials to the Texas Army. Uh, it is one of the fastest growing cities in the nation and was actually voted in the top 50 most desirable places to live in the country. This city has about 100,000 people in it. It boasts a lot of restaurants, entertainment, outdoor activities, you name it, they've got it. Let's go check it out. Landa Park is a must if you're in New Braunfels. This park offers so much. If you can see behind me, there's about six deer. Not sure if you can make them out, but this park is just so beautiful and pristine. It's quiet. It's surrounded by mature oak trees. They have a regular swimming pool, a spring fed pool. They have the river. They have picnic areas, volleyball courts. They have a train and they even have a golf course. So. Let's go check out Landa Park. One of the places that you gotta check out is the Kilmao River. Normally during the summer, this is just jam packed with inner tubers and kayakers, blaring music and drinking beer and just having a fantastic time. But we're in the off season now. But look how beautiful it is, it's super calm. 
the Comal River is actually fed from an underground spring, and that's why the water is so clear and why it's so calm. The other river to go check out is the Guadalupe River. Not so calm, not so clear, but great for some rapids. Slitterbond is a must when you come to New Braunfels. It is the number one water park in the state of Texas. I believe it's 12 or 13 years now. It's just insane. Every year it's just automatic. What's cool about Slitterbond is they let you bring in your own food and drinks. And they have cottages here that you can rent. So you don't have to worry about lodging, traffic, parking, long lines, nothing. You can just camp and then go swim and hang out in the lazy river or ride the slide. So that's why you've got to come check out Schlitterbahn when you come to the MBTS. You gotta visit Bucky's. If you've never been to Bucky's, you're in for a treat. They have taken pretty much everything you can think of and slapped the beaver on it. And it's just this crazy thing that started in Texas and is now spreading across the country. But you've gotta come check out Bucky's and say hi to the beaver. Creekside. Creekside is a must visit if you like shopping, if you like entertaining, and you like eating, or one of the three. You gotta come to Creekside when you're in New Braunfels.
since 1868, Nagelin's Bakery in New Braunfels producing phenomenal breads and pastries and donuts. And they are year after year after year voted the best bakery in New Braunfels. So if you're in New Braunfels, you've got to check out Nagelin's because they have the best stuff. They even have a donut with bacon and maples uh, frosting on it. So, got to check it out. Fortunately for me, my two favorite places downtown are Muck and Fuss for some good food and the Sidecar, which is a speakeasy underneath the Prince Psalms Hotel. And they play great jazz music and their drinks and food is phenomenal as well. So if you're downtown, you want some good food and you want to listen to some good live music, Muck and Fuss and the sidecar where you gotta go. Want some delicious, authentic German food? I know the spot. regular pretzel and crowns and the beer cheese. Good. Maybe this 
spicy mustard is not a good option. Fisher Park is one of a dozen or so parks within New Braunfels. It is probably the highest point in New Braunfels, so you get a fresh sense of being in nature without necessarily being surrounded by the hustle and bustle of the city. There's a lot of activities here for kids, including a water park. Let's go check it out and see why Fisher Park's one of the places you gotta come to when you're in New Braunfels.
as you can see, New Braunfels has a lot to offer. Shopping, the rivers, the parks, and just the, the ambiance downtown with all the restaurants and boutique shops. So, And don't forget the Bronx, 1847. That's when that theater got built. So if you have any questions about New Braunfels, if you like the video, reach out, let me know. Hit the like and subscribe button. I'd greatly appreciate it. And until next time, I'll see you in next destination.